The F-47, America's first sixth-generation fighter jet, has been flying in secret for years, and its reveal could change everything. A single blurred image is all we have, but what's hidden beneath that silhouette is a beast built to dominate, the skies. This isn't just another jet, it's a game changer paired with AI-driven drones that fight alongside it. Back in 2014, the Pentagon kicked off a classified project called the Dominance Initiative. They saw trouble brewing. The F-22 Raptor, a legend in air superiority, was running thin. Only 187 were ever built, and each one lost is gone for good. Its stealth and speed were unmatched, but it lacked the tech to keep up with today's electronic warfare. The F-35, versatile and stealthy, wasn't built for dogfights. Its jack-of-all-trades design left it vulnerable against rivals like China's new air defenses. The US needed something radical to stay ahead. And that's where the F-47's journey began. The Next Generation Air Dominance Program, or NGAD, was born to create a fighter that could outclass everything. Boeing, not Lockheed Martin, snagged the contract, a move that stunned analysts. Boeing's design promised all aspects stealth, meaning it's nearly invisible from every angle. Its blended wing body ditches, vertical fins, slashing its radar signature. But there was more. The F-47's adaptive cycle engines let it cruise at supersonic speeds without burning through fuel. This jet wasn't just built to fight, it was built to outlast. But the real kicker? It doesn't fly solo. Imagine a pack of AI-powered drones swarming the battlefield feeding data to the F-47 in real time. The General Atomics FQ-42 and Andriel FQ-44 are the wingmen this jet commands. These drones scout enemy territory, jam radars and even take out targets, all while the F-47 stays out of harm's way. The FQ-42 is a combat beast loaded with missiles for air-to-air -air strikes. The FQ-44 plays dirty, crippling enemy communications and acting as a decoy. Together, they turn the F-47 into a floating command center, orchestrating chaos without breaking a sweat. But how did Boeing pull this off? Boeing's stealth game goes back decades. In the 60s, they tested the Quiet, Bird, a prototype that toyed with radar evasion. By the 90s, their YF-118G Bird of Prey pushed the limits with curved wings and sneaky shapes. Even their X-32, though it lost to the F-35, taught them how to refine stealth. Boeing learned from every failure, building a playbook that led to the F-47, but they didn't do it alone. Northrop Grumman, masters of the B-2 spirit, chipped in with electronic warfare tech. Lockheed Martin, despite losing the main contract, likely supplied sensor fusion systems to sharpen the F-47's battlefield awareness. This jet is a team effort, and it's rewriting the rules. The F-47's range is another game-changer. China's anti-ship missiles like the DF-21D can hit carriers 4,000 kilometers out, forcing the F-35 to rely on vulnerable bases. The F-47 laughs at that. Its extended range lets it strike deep into enemy territory without needing a carrier nearby. Add infrared suppression to hide from heat-seeking missiles and this jet can slip through defenses like a ghost. But why was this project revived after years of delays. In 2025, President Trump rebooted the NGAD program, pouring funds into AI, stealth, and drone tech. Costs had stalled the project before, but the new administration saw the F-47 as a way to flex military, muscle and boost the economy. They even eyed exports to allies, spreading the jet's influence globally. This wasn't just about air superiority, it was about staying number one. But the road wasn't smooth. Boeing faced off against Lockheed Martin, the king of fighter. Jets? Lockheed's F-22 and F-35 gave them clout. But Boeing's cost-effective pitch and bold design won the Pentagon over. Some say it was a strategic move to keep Lockheed from dominating every major contract. Others point to Boeing's AI and drone integration as the edge. Either way, the decision sparked debates that still rage. And yet, the F-47 is already proving its worth. This jet's sensor fusion is next level. It pulls data from radar, infrared and electronic intel, painting a crystal clear picture of the battlefield. Pilots make split-second calls 
without jamming from enemy systems slowing them down. The F-47's drones amplify this, scouting ahead and neutralizing threats before they're even a problem. It's not just a fighter, it's a force multiplier. But what's next for this shadowy jet? The F-47's stealth isn't just about dodging. Radar. It's a masterclass in deception. Its radar-absorbent materials soak up enemy signals like a sponge, while its sleek, finless design scatters what's left. Even heat-seeking missiles struggle to lock on thanks to infrared suppression that keeps its engines cool under pressure. This jet can glide through the most heavily defended airspace, striking before anyone knows it's there. But the real genius lies in how it handles the chaos of modern warfare. And that's where its brain comes in. The F-47 sensor fusion system is like having a supercomputer in the cockpit. It pulls real-time data from satellites, drones, and its own sensors, crunching it faster than any human could. Enemy jets, missile launches, even hidden ground defenses, it sees everything. Pilots get a 360-degree view of the battlefield, updated every second. Unlike the F-35, which can lag under heavy electronic jamming, the F-47's AI filters out, the noise keeping decisions sharp. But this jet's power goes beyond its tech. It's changing how wars are fought. Swarm tactics are the F-47's secret weapon. Its AI drones, like the FQ-42 and FQ-44, don't just follow orders, they think. These drones can split up, surround enemies, or sacrifice themselves to protect the F-47. Picture a dozen drones jamming radars, firing missiles and feeding intel, all while the F-47 picks its moment to strike. This isn't one jet against the world, it's a networked killing machine. And that network is why adversaries like China are scrambling to catch up. But the F-47 story isn't just about tech, it's about survival. Building a jet this advanced wasn't cheap or easy. The NGAD program burned through billions, with delays piling up as engineers wrestled with bleeding-edge tech. Adaptive. Engines, AI integration, drone coordination, every piece pushed the limits. When costs skyrocketed, the project nearly died. But in 2025, Trump's push to outpace China and Russia brought it back. He saw the F-47 as a symbol of American dominance, not just a weapon. That bet paid off, but it came with risks. And those risks are still lurking. Boeing's win over Lockheed Martin wasn't just a business deal, it was a seismic shift. Lockheed's grip on fighter jet contracts made them the safe bet, but the Pentagon wanted fresh ideas. Boeing's focus on cost control and drone warfare tipped the scales. Critics argue it was a gamble, pointing to Boeing's spotty track record with projects like the 737 MAX. Others say it was a wake-up call for Lockheed to innovate. Either way, Boeing's now under pressure to deliver a jet that lives up to the hype. And the clock's ticking. The F-47's global impact is already rippling. Allies like Japan and the UK are eyeing it for their own air forces, drawn by its unmatched tech and export potential. But enemies are watching too. China's J-20 and Russia's Su-57 are evolving fast, with new radars designed to spot stealth jets. The F-47's drone swarm and long-range strike capabilities give it an edge, but for how long? As the arms race heats up, this jet's true test will be staying ahead of the curve. One thing's clear, the F-47 isn't just a fighter, it's a glimpse into the future of war. The F-47's official reveal is closer than you think. Test flights have been spotted, and whispers of its capabilities are spreading. It's built to counter China and Russia's advancing tech, from stealth-killing radars to hypersonic missiles. Its drones give it flexibility no other jet can match, letting it adapt to any mission. The US Navy's involvement hints at a future where this jet rules both air and sea, and with Boeing leading the charge, the F-47 could redefine warfare for decades. So what does this mean for the future? The skies are about to get a lot more dangerous, and the US is ready to own them.